Do you have another question? Um, I, I do, actually. This wasn't part of it. But if there is a problem with the suits, is, it, is there another backup plan? Is it possible for the astronauts to use the, the Sokol, um, the Russian suits? Or uh, what would be the options if there's continuing um, issues with the, uh, with the leaks and the helmets? Uh, well, I would be, uh, I'll say I would be surprised if we have a problem with, uh, um, with suits once we change out the uh, fan pump set. What we are learning is, is, is this problem is caused by uh, flowing um, water that has a high silica content through a um, centrifuge device, which is the fan pump set turns out to be, and then you create particulate. We think it occurs over a number of exposures. Um, we've looked at um, our filters, and the only saturated filter we found, uh, we uh, brought home in August of 2012. We had exposed both uh, 3011 and 3005 to this, um, uh, this overly saturated uh, filter. We, there's actually two filters in the system. We brought home the downstream particulate filter, and in there we had discovered, based on what was in there, that, that the ion filter in front of it was saturated. Unfortunately, we didn't know that at the time, and so we continued to use the ion filter. Both 3005 and 3011 were exposed to this. We believe it is highly likely this is, this is where the contamination came from. How it got introduced is something we're still trying to sort out. Uh, but we, we believe with clean filters, uh, it will, uh, the ion filter will trap the silicate. Uh, as was mentioned uh, by, I think Dina mentioned it, we had found that there's an excess, in this one case, there's an excessive amount of uh, chlor uh, chlorides and sulfates, which is not really important, other than if you know that what happens in an ion filter when those show up is they have an affinity towards the ion filter, and so they kick the silicates off. And when the silicates get kicked off, they get kicked off in large quantities, go into the flow stream, and then uh, once they get to a, a centrifuge-type device, they nucleate inside the pump, and then you start plugging up holes. So we, first of all, we believe that the lines we're using today are clean. We've put in new filters, um, and we think the filter system works. Um, 3015, you know, had the failure, it's possible it might have played a role in this at some point. Um, 3011 now has been completely, all of the components inside have been completely changed out. Um, and as, most importantly, it's been the fan pump set. So 3010 really wasn't exposed to this uh, particular line after, after we know it was saturated. Now, it, it was exposed once to this line uh, before we knew it was saturated, but it was early on. Um, and so we feel pretty good about uh, 3010. So I said all that to say is we go outside and we flood a suit. If it's 3011, we'll all be shocked. Um, but if we do flood a suit, then, then what we'll do is we'll go back inside and we'll look at the data. Uh, if it's 3010, um, then what we'll do is, and we still plan to do this, we just got to get them on orbit. And one of them is on Orb 1, and it's the reason why we were trying to fly Orb 1 first, uh, is a, to fly a clean uh, fan pump set. So we've got, uh, what we believe to be, be a clean one in 3011. We've got a, one that we know is clean, it's on Orb 1, and we'll fly, uh, as we sort our ways through this, anom uh, this anomaly, we intend to fly at least one more, if not two more, fan pump steps to make sure we know the condition of the fan pump steps in the suit. And when you do that, then at least for this particular failure no mode, even if we don't know root cause quite yet, we think we have a number of EVAs in these suits. And I would tell you that given what the team is learning on how to manage this pump, I think we've, we will probably be able to buy ourselves time. If we have a problem in CBA, we'll probably back out. And then we'll uh, talk about what plan B is. If we can get uh, a, a second fan pump step on Orb 1, we might try to do that and get it late loaded and, and then fly Orb 1 and then go back outside and do the EVAs. But if we can, if we can prevent having to do that, having to manage this loop in this, um, in this degraded state, we'd prefer to do that. Thanks so much for my short questions. All right, thanks, Irene. Uh, let's go to Ivan.